Here's what to do if you forgot your PIN number on an Android phone. Now, if you have your Android, but you don't remember the PIN to unlock it or to get in, I'm gonna show you some steps on how to get in anyway, or what to do. Now, the first option is, let's say you've already unlocked it. You can always swipe up from here, tap on settings, and then you can scroll down until you get to security and privacy. From here, you'll be able to see lock screen at the top. Let's tap on that and it will ask you to enter in your pin, but you forgot what your pin is. Now, whether you're in this screen or you just can't unlock your phone, I would recommend trying a few different times, trying a few different potential pins that you might've had on previous phones or for credit cards or debit cards, etc. Now, let's say that doesn't work. The next option that you have is to just open up a web browser. And what we're gonna do is type in Samsung Smart Things Find. Now, this is, of course, if you have a Samsung phone, you can see I have a Samsung Galaxy, but any phone has the Find My feature. So depending on which brand you have, just go to that website for the Find My feature. Now, here you can see Smart Things Find for Samsung. I can tap on it, and I'll just tap on Sign In, and I'm going to use my email here, and I'm going to autofill my password as well and hit sign in. Now, after I've signed in, the cool thing is it will register that specific device, even if you don't have that specific PIN number. Now on here, all you have to do is find that specific phone and you have some options. Now on here, you can set to lost mode if you wanted to tap on that and essentially it will lock it and then you can go in and unlock it basically by entering in a new pin. Or from here, you can also tap on erase data and it will pop up with a splash screen that will walk you through the potential options in terms of erasing the data if you don't remember that pin. Now, the last option you have is if you have the physical phone with you, you can always just do a factory reset on that phone. Unfortunately, you don't have a lot of options if you don't know that PIN number or if you don't have a Samsung account linked to that specific phone, you might need to just completely wipe it and then start over setting up a new Android phone. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks, guys.